Y'all, what's going on with you? Listen, I'm Zabi D. Morgan, holistic life and business coach and business owner, y'all. And I'm out here ready to get the baby off the bus. But it just came to my mind to come here and be a word of inspiration for someone who needs to hear it, right? Because when you are a non-traditional business owner or when you are the type of individual who aren't just growing a one-something, even if you have, you know, you have some of those people who, have a one business but they have several levels to their business i'm not even talking about them i am talking about a person with several entities right um in layman's terms someone who is building a corporation of entities all right let me tell you something especially when you're from the ground up um you know nothing has been handed to you you're not no one you haven't bought into anything you're not franchising anything everything that you got going on is from your own hands it's from your own doings all your connections uh yours type of thing right um it is you're not going to be you are not going to be understood by everyone you are not even going to be liked by everyone um a lot of people are going to think that what you have going on is absolutely nuts like you have no direction you just out here doing things um, you know, some foolish people may even say, oh, you got all these businesses, but you don't have the money to show for it type of thing, right? Um, and even, and th this is even people who are, you know, in a sense that are business advisors and business coaches and probably done went to school for business and, you know, all of these things. Even them, even them, they still may not understand you because, you know, not simply because a person have went to school or they consider themselves or have, you know, the, the skills to be a business advisor or, or, or um, you know, just that in the third, they still may not be privy to what it takes for an individual to have several companies, right, to, to be growing a corporation. Maybe they are only knowledgeable about the individual who just have this one business, you know, how to, they know how to educate a business owner on operating a business, you know, not, not educating a business owner on how to operate a corporation with several entities underneath of it. And so, you know, um, I just wanted to, I just wanted to come here and tell you that God didn't give the same portion that you have to, to other people. God didn't give them the idea. God didn't give them the creative space to, you know, be able to understand what that looks like. God, God didn't do that. Okay. It was given to you. And so sometimes these people that you feel should have the knowledge or the capacity to understand where you've been coming from with your super large portion that God gave you, you may be teaching them something. Okay. Don't forget that. All right. And it's going to always be somebody running their mouth behind your back about some stuff to the next person. And if no one has taken the time to really get to understand you or know who you are, they're going to believe it. <laughs> they're going to believe it. And if they don't create space to, you know, um, you know, so they can see otherwise and they can continue to believe it. But don't you break your back. Don't you bust a sweat trying to convince them otherwise. Don't do that. That's their problem. And if they lose out on you, the opportunity of knowing you, then they just lose out on the opportunity of knowing you or working with you. Don't don't even double back. You understand what I'm saying? Just keep it moving. And it don't got to be no love loss. I love you people. Bye.